Hello, and I'd like to welcome you all once again to the old schoolhouse here in the village of Butterstone in Perthshire for this, our 11th live broadcast. <laughs> and it feels like being on tour, I'll say it's, it's, it's crazy. Anyway, um, lovely uh, welcome anybody who's new to this. We're actually in the old village school. I tell this every night, but and the, the people who are tuning in regularly will be getting fed up of hearing this, but I have to explain where we are, because we're actually in um, the, 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 the little village school. That, the Butterstone was a little village of is a little village of 10 houses, and this is where all the rural kids were taught. And this is the, the, the village, the one-room village school, and it's where I went to school, and my dad went to school here in the 1930s, and, uh, and I've made all my records in here. I was lucky to buy it a number of years ago and, and turn it into a recording studio, and I've made all my records in this room. So it's great to be able to be recorded, be uh, broadcasting from this in these um, weird times. Um, I... Um, I try to make it feel like a little concert rather than you know so that it feel so that you can get your you know the, the bottle of wine out and the and the crisps and the, the you know the the popcorn and things and sit down and you know you can watch it on YouTube on your big telly or whatever you know and um, make it feel like an actual wee gig. Um, I'm going to do a, this first couple of songs I'm going to do. I'm trying not to repeat myself, so I'm starting to get to the difficult s songs now that I haven't sung for years. And uh, it's quite tricky because uh, you just don't have them at the back of your brain. And this next couple of songs, I've got, I make wee r r riffs for my songs. And sometimes I make wee riffs around my kitchen table and they're fine. But then try to play them on stage. They're, they're like tongue twisters, you know. They might not be very difficult, but they're kind of like one of these funny tongue twistery type of riffs. So this song has one of them. And uh, so we'll see how we go on. And I'll, uh, so I'll start with this. I made a wee mistake today too. I forgot to put our beautiful lights on charge. So I uh, might end up singing in the darkness by the time we get to the end of the half hour. Keep our fingers crossed and we'll see how we go on. I 
have had thy toll of eternal life. Way up here I've seen the wasted youth. From up here I've heard the old man cry, saying, Who am I? Life teaches nothing, life teaches what it can. It can hold us all to ransom, the woman and the man. Over the mountain and out across the trees, on feathered wings, silent, silent. From up here I've seen the broken truth I have had that old eternal life Way up here I've seen the wasted youth From up here I've had the old Saying, who am I? Thank you very much. Um, I'm assuming that you'll be clapping. Maybe you get you now that we're on the eleventh show, you'll not be so self-conscious about clapping in front of your laptops and your phones now. Um, anyway, that's my song. Who am I? And, and actually, it came from watching a buzzard above our house here, uh, flying and kind of looking around. He was looking down. She was looking down. You know, this buzzard and 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 I got to think it was at a time when things were really sort of tough. There was all kinds of terrible stuff on the go and humanity wasn't being very good at the time and and uh, and I was just imagining this 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 buzzer looking down going what's going on down there what are they doing you know what what on earth are they doing they, to each other you know anyway that's where that song came from and uh, I'm going to do this song now and I, I um I've been lucky to spend a bit of time in Australia and uh, I visited a wee town uh, I think it's North Queensland uh, called McLean <laughs> which I was kind of really you know I was really enjoyed myself being in the, the town of McLean, and uh, it's an amazing place, right up in the north in New South Wales, and it's um, it's uh, very very hot up there. And I got to reading about the people that kind of had settled there, and the the, uh, the Scots that had gone along there and, and settled. And um, basically, th th there's a big river which runs through McLean called the Clarence River. And uh, every year it floods this Clarence River, and it's full of really bad things like sh crocodiles and sharks and bad spiky fish and stuff like that, you know. And uh, and it floods every year. And not in Scotland, you know, maybe when we get a flood, we maybe up three or four meters of a of, of a flood. This river, when it flooded, it was like 10, 20 meters it flooded, you know. And um, and I was imagining these poor wee Scottish people arriving there, you know, because the it was just virgin bush. They had to clear the bush. And then you know, and then and then the only crop they could grow was uh, sugar cane, which I mean, they've never, I mean they're more p more likely potatoes that a Scot would be used to put planting. But anyway, this was sugar cane, and um, and I just got to imagine the poor folk, you know, um, 
uh, and, and they're, um, they're, they're trying to kind of deal with this big river and this heat and the bad, dangerous things that were around. <laughs> and, uh, and in the book, it talked about a, a ship called the, the George Fife, which was the ship that had kind of taken a lot of them out. And a lot of them had died on the way out. It was extremely a horrendous kind of uh, journey. So this is another one of these songs with the...
That's my song, Big River. And, uh, it's got a dog of a little riff there. That's a dog of a little riff. And no wonder I don't sing that at my concerts. You know, I'm too terrified to do that. At least um, nobody can throw anything at me here in the, in the school. Actually, I've got it set up like a, co like a concert. So I've got rows of seats here. And uh, they're empty. It's a wee bit kind of symbolic of the kind of times that we're in. Um, I'm going to do this song now. This is where I, I do a wee song... Um, with a chorus for you all to join in with and uh, oh my the wee lights are hanging in there um, this is a wee s song with a, a chorus and uh, but before I do that I have to <laughs> those of you who have been watching the shows will know about Mr. Uh, um, Tatty Tatty face here who because we've got this automated system there's just me and Jenny in this room and uh, my son before this all the lockdown uh, happened we we set up this kind of automated four camera thing where 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 the cameras will do their own thing and um but i because i've got to set the cameras up and do all the kind of focusing and things and that you know and framing up i needed something to throw so so mr um Mr. Tattyface offered to be able to be the kind of guy that would stand here while I do that. And he plays a bit of guitar. And those of you who have seen my Facebook page, his brother, Duncan Tattyface, has arrived in my garden. And like I said on the Facebook, he describes himself as a professional tatty bogle, which is a kind of uh, Scottish for a scarecrow. And he's out there at the moment sca scaring crows. He said he was hiding in the shed for a month, kind of doing a wee bit of, um, uh, you know... Uh, isolation thing going on in there but uh, so he's he's fine um but my mum my, my 84 year old mother lives in Dunkel, which is about three miles from here and uh, she's an amazing lady and she'll be watching tonight hello her, her name's Darlena and hi hi mum and uh, so because of all this stuff she t my, my daughter on a Friday comes up with some messages because Jenny and I are not leaving the house and my daughter brings a, us up a kind of uh, Red Cross par 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 parcel with uh, food and that in it and lo and behold it, with the Red Horse par th with the parcel was my mum my mother who's a fantastic knitter and makes and she's very good with her hands made the little tatty face now I don't know if Jenny can switch to the fourth camera maybe can you so that we can see him He's absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> and he, he, uh, he, um, so the Tatty Face family are getting bigger and bigger and bigger here. I'm going to get, you know, but my mother made that, made him, and he's absolutely fantastic. I'll, set, I'll put a proper photograph up on Facebook tomorrow, but anyway. So <laughs> maybe he, I think he's son of Tatty Face. We don't know yet. We just, it just happened about an hour ago, so we'll have to find out uh, what the actual story is. Okay, so I'm going to do this song. And he can he can help out down there. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. So um, yeah, this song has got an easy chorus. You sing. Um, I thought kind of you know these times that we're in, you know, we we're, we're doing terrible things to the planet and. Uh, <laughs> And uh, I, I had this kind of idea that humanity would be like the prodigal son and you know, come back to the planet eventually and say, look, I'm really sorry, you know, I'm really sorry, we've screwed it all up, you know, I'll, I'll try and be, I'll try and be better, you know, I'll be. And so the chorus is, I'll be your loving one, I'll be your loving one, from the point of no return, I'll be your loving one. Okay, so we'll try it. And uh, there's a wee guitar piece in this as well. So the, the chorus is... Um, 
simple. You'll get that as we go through. But the wee guitar bit's a bit more complicated. And the wee guitar bit, are you, are you ready, <laughs> Mr. Sutterfield? But I want you to do the guitar bit too at home, you know, and uh, it goes like this. Da 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 1950s Fender Telecaster electric guitar. So it'll be more kind of like down, 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 down. <laughs> no. no, I'm joking. No, don't do that. That would be, that'd be silly. Just do that. So we'll do it one more time. There are changes that have led us to this place. Oh, some formed from our wonder and some from. I forgot to put the guitar mic on.
past But it's only in the present very much and uh, that was my song um, Loving One and um, I hope you enjoyed singing along with that it's, um, d don't you think uh, I think Mr Tatty Face did some fantastic guitar work on that to be honest with you um, anyway um, we're going to finish now uh, with this wee song and uh, it's kind of uh, it's a kind of hopeful wee song and um, but it came from um, Losing my, uh, losing, uh, I, I, when I was growing up, um, I had a bachelor uncle, Bob, who, who uh, stayed with us, and um, he, had, he wasn't very well, he had very bad asthma, and so he, 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 he stayed with us, and, uh, and it was brilliant, you know, I, and I thought everybody had a mum and a dad and an uncle, Bob, you know, because it was great when I fell out with my father, and uncle, Bob was there, and you could have a moan with him, moan with him you know, and, if I was needing an extra bit of money to go out to dances or, a, you know, I could always go and tap Uncle Bob and he'd always kind of show up or something, you know. And uh, so I was heartbroken when he passed away. And uh, I wrote this wee song um, uh, from that because somebody...
So it's called Hide in the Wind. Because somebody said to me, they said, you don't lose people, you know. They just hide in the wind, you know. They're just hiding in the wind. And I thought that was a lovely way of, uh, of explaining that. And uh, particularly in this particular time that we're in at the moment, it's maybe it's a wee bit kind of relevant. And uh, uh, Jenny's mum was a, a concert pianist, and she um, with the Sydney Symphony Orchestra, and, and uh, sadly uh, passed away quite young with uh, cancer. And uh, but uh, she's in this song as well. Come, the light is leaving. What was sure will soon be gone. What was certain falls and fades away. And though we search, the fields are empty. And through the forest, there's not a sign. And the words we share. I know. 
Thank you very much. And um, that brings us uh, once again to the end of our um, wee half an hour uh, show. Um, I'd like to thank uh, all my wee team. There's only me and Jenny in the school here, but, my, but Jamie and Julia and Tanya and Taj are, are out there monitoring all this uh, out down at their own places. Uh, we're all kind of in, all in lockdown here. So, um, and this is a point too where I, I always like to thank, and this is one of the reasons why I was doing these shows, is to thank all the people who are working in the NHS and uh, all the carers and all that. Uh, in fact, I was out last night with my, you know, out, there's only 10 houses in the village, but it was with me and Jenny were out applauding you. Thank you so much. This is for all the, all the people that are helping uh, to keep the wheels of our lives going in this uh, crazy, dangerous situation. And um, I really uh, appreciate it. And, uh, and not just the, 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 the NHS and, the, and the, the carers, but the bin men, the guys that come around with my delivery, with the deliveries, the, the people that are working in the checkouts at the, at the supermarkets. I mean, I could the list of all these amazing people who are sort of just getting stuck in and tackling the whole thing and putting their own lives at in, in, in risk for for the rest of us and uh, and, uh, and and it's, it's absolutely brilliant. So, um, I'll um, I'll leave you with that. We thought I uh, hope you're all uh, looking after your, your each other and, uh, and making sure that uh, the folk in your wee community are all are all kind of staying uh, safe and 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 positive. And uh, and I'll leave you with this. Uh, we glass of port. That's it. Belong this is my good friend Nigel gave me a 1985 glass, uh, bottle of port and I've opened it. So, Slanjava, till the next one will be on Sunday night at 8 o'clock. Uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, Sunday. So, until then, I uh, th hope you've enjoyed yourselves and uh, you all stay safe and uh, and take care. Bye.